So a recent post uh, by GameSpot on Biomutant dropped a few extra details on the game you may be interested in and today we check them out. How's it going guys? My name is DPJ and if you enjoyed the video leaving a like really helps out and if you like what you see and want to see more Biomutant on a daily basis be sure to subscribe. So the game spot post drops a few answers to I know questions many of you have about this game. Now the game spot article is actually full of great details on the game, but most I have covered already. So let's get into those juicy details I believe you'd want to know. So guys, I can confirm this game will have its own photo mode. And while with the game being so beautiful as it is, this is going to be something many of us enjoy using and sharing around those amazing pictures. I can actually not wait for this. So yes guys, photo mode for Biomutant is confirmed. So what about multiplayer? Will there be any kind of multiplayer within this game? Will there be any kind of co-op play? Well guys, unfortunately there will not be any kind of multiplayer on release for this game. But as crazy as it sounds, I don't feel this game needs it, I feel it's probably best played solo and with recent releases of games and the multiplayer and having so many issues, to be honest, I want a chill game. I want a game I can sit back and play solo and this is definitely that. So what about post launch content, DLCs, seasonal events, will there be any of this great stuff? And has anything been mentioned or confirmed by the Game Developers Experiment 101? Well this is what's said. Other than fixing any issues stemming from player feedback, Experiment 101 currently has no plans to add any post launch content. However, the studio stresses that doesn't mean it won't ever add more content. For now though, its focus is polishing up the base game, which is completely understandable. And the way this game's picking up and gaining that traction, if it is as good as how it seems it will be, I'm pretty certain it's going to be a popular game and I'm pretty certain there will be DLC in the future. So what about the other side of us spending additional money on a base game? Microtransactions. Now I know some people are against microtransactions, others don't mind them. Me personally, if they add to the game I'm enjoying and I believe I'm getting my money's worth, as long as there isn't that gambling aspect like loot boxes, I ain't against microtransactions and I'm all up for supporting the developers if the game is great. I mean it's your money, you spend it how you please. But developers clearly who just take the piss with microtransactions, which we've seen so many times in the past, I'm against, I have no time for this. So will Biomutant have any microtransactions? Well, not quite. So in addition to Biomutant's five classes, we do notice five in the base game, a sixth class called the Mercenary will be available as a pre-order bonus. This class will also be sold individually, but not until sometime after launch. Beyond that, however, Experiment 101 confirms Biomutant will have no microtransactions of any kind. So lastly for today's video people, will this game ever be on next gen or will it be upgraded to next gen? As believe it or not, this game is made for last gen even as beautiful as it seems. It is made for the PS4 and Xbox One. So will we ever see a next gen upgraded version or an update on the version we play with backwards compatibility? Will we ever see a next gen slash current gen version? So Biomutants Developers Experiment 101 says a native PS5 and Xbox Series X version won't be available at launch. It hasn't confirmed or denied that a current gen version will ever happen, however we'll just have to wait and see, that's what GameSpot said. And that is it guys, I mean this looks amazing as you have seen on that last gen. I honestly couldn't imagine how great it would be on that next gen. I guess we will just have to look at a high end PC version. But yeah guys those are the details that have came out of this GameSpot article on Biomutant. The game releases on May 25th and I cannot wait for it, not long now guys. And yes I will keep you up to date with all the latest news surrounding the game. I'll be streaming it every day as well as daily videos so make sure you subscribe if you haven't already. But guys on that note the end of the video has arrived, if you enjoyed it leaving a like really helps out. If you're new around here and want to see more Biomutant on a daily basis be sure to subscribe and if you never want to miss a video I upload you can turn notifications on. 
by hitting that bell button but guys thanks as always for stopping by and hopefully I will see you on that next one.